Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice math problem involving square roots? From here, what we have inside, which is 25 over 5 minus 24. From here, we can rationalize this by multiplying the numerator and denominator by the conjugate sort of the denominator. And here we have times. 5 plus root 24 here yeah. then also we multiply this as well by 5 plus root 24 then from what we have up here 25 we open the bracket and 25 times 5 we have 125 then plus here we have 25 root 24 then divided by yeah this follows from perfect square when we have a minus b into bracket a plus b and this same thing as a square minus b square so yeah this same thing as 5 square here then minus root 24 squared and from here this becomes 125 plus 25 root 24 then divided by what we have here 5 square we have 25 then minus here square cancel square root we have 24 here then from here, 25 minus 24, that's 1. So here, same thing as 125 plus 25 root 24 over 1, which is still same thing as this. Then, since what we have there is having square root, here, we introduce the square root back here. Then what you have here becomes square root of 125 plus 25 root 24. That is, here we can break it down and make this to be square root of 75 plus 50. That's the same thing as 125. Then plus, here we can write 25 as root 25 times root 25 then we can write root 24 here as root 4 times 3 times 2 and from there this same thing as square root of 75 plus 50 then plus here we can bring this together in the same square root and we have root 25 times 25 sorry please root 25 times 25 then here we have times here we can separate this as root 4 then times root 3 times 2 from here then here root 4 is 2 and this gives us square root of 75 plus 50 then plus here we have 2 then root here we can bring this together from when we have root a times root b we can bring it together inside same root as root a times b so everything we have here let's take it together under one root as root 25 times root 25 then times 3 times 2 from here that is here we have 25 times 3 here we give us 75 and 25 times 2 here will give us 50. 
So this becomes square root of 75 plus 50 then plus 2 times square root of 75 times 50 then from here we can also separate this and this will become square root of 75 plus 50 then plus 2 times root 75 times root 50 from here and then from here we can write this from when we have a square plus b square plus 2ab that is here this gives us a plus b all squared then it implies that here we can write root, we can write 75 as a root 75 square and this becomes square root of root 75 square here this when square cancel square root we still give us 75 then plus same thing here we can write 50 as root 50 square then we have plus 2 times root 75 then times root 50 from here and when we compare this with what we have here here a is serving as root 75 then b is serving as root 50 that is what we have here we simply become square root of into bracket root 75 plus root 50 all squared then from here the square here cancel the square roots and we are left with root 75 plus root 50 that is from here we can rewrite root 75 as root 25 times 3 then root 50 as root 25 times 2 and which when we separate this we have root 25 times root 3 then plus root 25 times root 2 and here we have root 25 common we factor it out we have root 25 into bracket root 3 plus root 2 from here and what we have here root 25 is 5 so we have 5 into bracket root 3 plus root 2 which here is the final answer to this given problem so therefore what is given here is same thing as 5 into bracket root 3 plus root 2 and thank you for watching don't forget this step subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell share this video see you next class and bye for now